What's up Pyros? Today we're going to take a look another stash update. This is the second one of 2021. Now some of these I got at the end of last year and I actually put them up in the stash video. But I wanted to go over some specialty items. As you can see here we got some tall rockets. You got your articles of pyrotechnic cases. You got some awesome shells that you all should know about. You got the traditional ZR zombie revenge. And then you got a raccoon a zipper cake. So we'll start over here on the left. We got the six inch master shells 100 you guys already know what these are giant six inch shells as you see i kind of tested two out for myself was blown away uh they're better than the dog shells you don't know what dog shells i'm talking about I'm talking about right there dogs won't stop barking so these are extremely good i'm glad i got a case of them so i got three 24 packs definitely definitely check them out if you guys ever come across them next we got the gold zipper cake by raccoon uh, let's see if we can carefully without knocking everything down see how many shots we got oh. Oh, not gonna count me the shots I believe it was hundred and fifty shots I believe let's see if I can find it just everything's falling over of course right now so yeah it's the the goal by raccoon obviously you got the French colors on there never seen it in a plastic wrap before that's something new I mean it's like completely sealed he wrapped I thought that was different and unique. Red and green lemon strobing comments. Finale, red, green, lemon strobing tails. The crackling, red plum blossom. So, got some red lace effects. I don't know if it's going to have a shot count. Oh, here we go. Yeah, 102 shots. Okay, my apologies. So, 102 total shots. Got a nice figure looking at us. So, that is the goal by Raccoon Fireworks. Next to that, we got a case of the Zeppelin. You only see three here. Um, I did get four. Test the one out. Had to definitely check out what it was like in person. I loved it. It's got a lot of crackle, a lot of sound. It's a overall great cake. Again, it's the articles of pyrotechnic. So you gotta have some training to get one of these. But uh, if you guys do have your training or license, your ATF, you can definitely come across that. Down here at the bottom, you guys might know that one. Balrog. I believe this is 66 shot cake if i can remember right got a case of that definitely excited to try one of them out um i loved this cake um two years ago i believe i had it yeah i got it two years ago nazgul typically i see it in a 100 shot version this is not that version it's still angled it's less shots i got two cases that's why you see eight of them here all i know is this version i have not shot yet so hopefully it's as good as the 100 shot version uh, that we used to get. Um, I think I shot the two Nazguls, one of my 4th July in 2019, and the other one was in the middle of my 5,000 shot, 5,000 subscriber video. So hopefully this version, it's less shots, hopefully it's still impactful. Um, obviously here on the end, we got the biggest and tallest rockets that I've ever come across here in the States. Um, it's funny because uh, these are not from the States, which is why I think we're able to get them. So I mean, you can see how tall this one is. You back up for scale. So, I mean, I'd say, see, if I'm 6'1", I'd say about 5 feet tall with a stick. All I know is uh, this thing is massive. It's definitely like a 3-inch shell sphere around the actual stuff. And I believe these are based out of the UK. Yeah. Uh, minimum age limit for UK market 18 years year production 2017 so these actually come in a four assortment by is it bright star fireworks out of UK yeah if you can see that let's tilt that not the rocket yeah bright star fireworks makes these out of the UK I only got two of them we got the King Python and Warlord would have loved to get the other two hopefully we'll come across more of these later in the year all I know is uh, these are some massive rockets. It's supposed to go up pretty high. I'd say at least as high as a three inch shell or taller in height. So just intrigued to have two of them. By far the biggest rockets I've ever seen in person, let alone can't wait to shoot them. 
Um, behind that, we have the star rocket. Now, this, got to be careful here, as the top like to come off and the motors like to come off. So I will have to hot glue this, basically construct it myself. See if we got the manufacturer here. I believe this, let's see, was this a Belgium, I believe? Yeah, Belgium. So that is uh, where my family originates from, is out of Belgium. So it's nice to be able to try one of their fireworks that they made over there. Got six of them. Oh, there you go. Perfect representation. Um, be careful if you guys come across these the motors, just fall right out. So, gotta okay, be careful. You got to probably hot glue them yourselves because these you don't want to have a, a motor go up with the rocket and it not ignite the actual head because it's gonna be some nice sound head brakes. So, I'm just intrigued to try one of those out. Those are probably about eh, four feet. Three and a half, four, maybe five. I don't know. I have to get a tape measure out when I actually shoot them so I get the actual height. But I mean, you can see the size difference. I mean, as tall as seven 500 gram cakes tall, uh, whatever that is, or just about 224 packs stacked on top of each other. I know these are. So, and then I got these last year. Uh, at the end of last year, it's a new zombie revenge. I haven't seen these. I hope they're not all just color. Uh, there are three in there that are empty because I did test them out and I found out they are not colored. They are um, what we all like to see out of uh, the gray cans. Hopefully, I can get some uh, comparison between these and the old school grays. All I know is uh, 24 shells. Hard to come by this year. So I'm glad I got my sound, sound color, color, and just crazy right there. So Pyros, this is my little stash update. Hope you Pyros enjoy. I've um, got... Uh, another stash update coming next weekend um possibly because we're going to be doing the schneider's pickup down in uh, st joe missouri because they got their demo and then i also will be doing uh, a pickup from fireworks forever at the end of may beginning of june so got at least two more stash editions that i know of might be pulling up uh, one from hales but uh haven't seen them get an order from them yet um they don't have anything in stock that i can buy because i'm not a big um buyer so I'm a last one to get my order fulfilled. So hopefully at the end of June, I might be able to get something from Hales Fireworks. Uh, if there's any way I can jump on anyone's order from Hales and you know that they have product, I can give you the items that I want to get. But uh, yeah, I think we'll just leave it there, Pyros. I hope you enjoy. As always, uh, thanks for checking out the Stash Update. And I'll see you, Pyros, next time. Mm -hmm.